I actually can't believe we're here doing another pack opening. But I gotta say, I'm super excited for this one because if you didn't see my video, what, yesterday? I dropped an NBA draft pack opening. But now, 2K released new packs being these sleepers packs. And this pack art is mint. I don't say that word often, but to be honest, it's probably my favorite pack art we've ever got. And speaking of um, sleep, I just woke up, by the way. But hey, am I excited for these packs? Yes and no. Because if we have a look at the players, we've got a Ruby, DeAndre Jordan, an Amethyst, Isaiah Thomas, Diamond Michael Red, Diamond Paul Millsap, and then a Pink Diamond Nikola Jokic. So all those players, I don't think I'm going to use any of them. But the thing is, if we come over to the set, if you get all five of them and lock it in, you get a Pink Diamond Chris Middleton. But the thing is, with these sets, once you complete all all of them, you do actually get a pink diamond J.R. Smith. But I don't know why it says that we need six players. I swear it was only five. Maybe that's a glitch. We'll just have to find out. Because this set has been pretty expensive for me to do. That I'm kind of excited that I think we finally are about to get our final piece. I hate my hair. I'm getting a haircut today, by the way. So don't worry. Anyways, time to go into this new VC screen on the PS5 and buy even more. And as we just came off doing that, let's see if we can get how many? 1,800 likes in this video. I know you guys can do that. Anyway, it's time to get into our first box this is by far my favorite pack art we've ever got i think ever in 2k i'm not even lying but our first 20 pack box up one of the craziest things that ever happened in these packs release that happened it was for detlef shrimp we completed the whole set in one box so if we're able to do that i will go absolutely crazy because that means i don't need to wait to actually get this jr smith and i can get a gameplay out for you guys asap so we need to see those shakes we also need to see deandre jordan that's the only one we need that is below an amethyst but starting out not really the best on pack number four and we do get a shake that's what we like to see pink diamond it is a diamond that's better than getting an amethyst and let's see which one out of the what two diamonds it's going to be so from the western conference 93 overall number 24 power forward that means it is going to be none other than paul Millsap. it took me forever to actually remember that but paul Millsap, let's go as i'm opening up these packs i'm cut what that just said get a quadruple double sure thing but look at how far the back of the pack art is like that kind of reminds me of my jerseys now that i'm looking at that but one diamond already on pack number four i always feel like that's a lucky pack for me maybe we can get another one in the first 10 packs i'd be extremely happy with that so number seven and that's a sapphire. All right, it's fine. You want to know why it's fine? Because number eight is a shake once again, and it's going to be great with the pink diamond. It's another diamond. Okay, I'm not complaining at all with that. Hoping one of the new diamonds this is not a duplicate. Eastern Conference, 93 overall. That means it is going to be whoever the other player was. Um, Michael Red. Yeah, it is. And this card could actually be really good too. Maybe a sleeper. If you, get, if you get what I'm saying. So now literally all we need is just Isaiah Thomas, DeAndre Jordan, and uh, and the pink diamond. Wow, we just got another shake. This could be a pink diamond. Bam, it's an amethyst. So this should be Isaiah Thomas. Then it means we only need two more players. Sure, it is the best one being Nikola Jokic. But once we get that, we're literally done. This is going to be our boy Isaiah Thomas. Yes, um, it's the short Isaiah Thomas. He looks kind of funny because he's so short. We're only just halfway through this box and we just got back-to-back -back shakes. Unfortunately, nothing in this one and not DeAndre Jordan. So DeAndre Jordan and Nikola Jokic is the only thing we need to see in these packs. And I'm going to be super happy if we do. Sure, this box has gone pretty well, but number 12, there's the Ruby. DeAndre? Ooh. No, okay, um... That's even more annoying. But yeah, it actually did just remind me there, seeing the championship ring on that Nikola is the fact that we do actually have the final week of limited to get the final, the, to get the sixth ring. And if we get that sixth ring, we get Jalen Brown, the pink diamond that we've been trying to grind for for quite a while. So I'm excited for that, I guess, I, I guess except I'm not really excited for what we're getting here. I do actually want to see what the restrictions are for limited because um, I feel like I'm seeing pretty much every player is usable. But number 17, the second half of the box really hasn't been too great. We haven't even seen DeAndre Jordan. So number 18 um, is this the one with the shake pink diamond. okay it's only an amethyst i don't know why i always do that like go over and say pink but um it is an amethyst and western conference 90 overall not number 22 that means it is going to be another isaiah thomas so um i mean it's a player from the set it, it's cool though that's one of my favorite card arts throughout this whole game and as i was streaming the other day someone did actually mention that like the card art and the pack art has been the best it's ever been in 2k and I gotta say, I think I agree. Like, I love it so much. Speaking of George Hill, he got traded, didn't he? I'm pretty sure he did. Anyway, the final pack of this box, 
a gold. That's a good box though. So yeah, we have now pulled three out of five of the players. One of them's only a Ruby. The other one is Jokic. And how much is this man going for? Not even that much. But it'll be so much more satisfying if we're able to pull all the players. Actually, I need to check limited. Hey, 2020 rookies, second round picks and undrafted players only. Okay. One diamond and above allowed. Okay. All other players, Ruby and below. That's actually, it's actually pretty tough. I can't lie. But I am going to be streaming me getting this Jalen Brown. So be sure to check down below in the description or just type this in your browser fb.gg slash killsamoy because that's where I stream pretty much every single day. Wow, we also got 26 challenges. That is a lot. And I'm super close to being able to get Blake Griffin. So I guess I'll do that on stream as well. But the most important thing for now is that we complete this set. So another 20 pack box. That first one wasn't bad. Let's hope the second one can be even better. Literally all we need to see is just one shake and for it to be the pink diamond. That's all I want to see out of this box. So 2K, can you do your boy good? Can we, can we, can we see it? Can we do it once again without opening up every single, every single bit of VC? <sighs> I, I believe, I believe. Yo, one thing that I noticed when I was editing my video yesterday is how much nicer my mic quality is with my new mic and also the fact that my PS4 isn't just going off in the background because we do have the PS5 right now. So number six, that is what we want to see. Please be, okay, it's still just... An amethyst. Like, I get so excited when I see the shake, and then I get a little bit disappointed if it is just like this, only an Isaiah Thomas. But we're getting there, all right? It's just moving its way up. This is the box for the Joker to hit me up, I believe. And especially that was just early in the box. We got our amethyst. So it's just warming up, all right? Warming up. And uh, next pack up. I find it crazy that we still haven't seen a single DeAndre Jordan. But number eight is always great because it's Nikola Jokic just like, okay, it's another, it's another amethyst. Um, maybe I have to try something different when I actually go over to the packs because I feel like every time now I'm just going to be negative because I think it's going to be another Isaiah Thomas. But um, yep, there, there we go. Once again, we'll take it. I actually just realized what this pack means. Like sleepers as in, I thought it meant like sleepers as in like players that, you know, aren't really talked about too much, but it's draft sleepers. Um, my brain finally clicked because I remember Isaiah Thomas was like the last pick in the whole draft. Um, like pick number 30 in the second round, I'm pretty sure. And that's one that I remember, but the others must be pretty much the same. And there we go with another shake. I, I know this is an amethyst. You ready? Okay, it, it didn't go up. It was kind of a joke that it was going to be an amethyst. But I'm happy with the diamond because we can definitely sell this and then we'll be able to afford Nikola Jokic 100%. But I want JL Smith right now. I think it's the final player we need. I'm not 100% sure because it seems glitched. But I, I swear we only need five. We got Michael Red though. That's probably the better one. Michael Red's always good in 2K. So what? We got an amethyst, two amethysts and also a diamond. That's a pretty good box. Just weird, we've pulled all these cards and not a single Ruby DeAndre Jordan. I mean, I can just buy him. He's only going for like 3K, but I just find it weird that we haven't been able to pull him. So number 16 now, and there's a Ruby. Is this finally him? Yes, it is. That card art is crazy. It kind of looks like a galaxy opal in the background, hey. But literally all we need now, all we need as we get an amethyst in the middle, it's probably gonna be Isaiah Thomas is just the Joker, Nikola Jokic, and then we've completed this set. So, I mean, there we go. We got another Isaiah Thomas. We've got two more packs to go in this box. I'm kind of nervous because I, I feel like we're just one player away. It's getting me nervous because I want to get the final one that we need being the Joker, the pink diamond. If we see the pink diamond glow, I'm getting hyped. And unfortunately, not in this box. We're going to have to do another. We do get my boy Benjamin though. Ladies and gentlemen, we are literally only one card away and it's the Joker. I have faith in this box. Let's open it up and let's see how we go. Also, I do think in my live stream today, as I said on Facebook, I am actually going to be getting the pink diamond Blake Griffin. So it's going to be a big stream. The fact that I think I'm going to be playing with JR Smith. Actually, I definitely will be. We just got Ben Simmons and then we get Joel Embiid. All right. So I'm going to be getting Blake Griffin. I'm going to be playing with JR Smith. And then I'm also, what was the other thing? I think I actually forgot what the other thing was, but I'll, I'll remember. We'll get Jalen Brown. That's what I'm saying. But another shake there, please. It actually is. We've done it. We've done it. We've got a pink diamond. I didn't think this one was going to be good. But we just pulled Nikola Jokic, which means now we have pulled every single card needed in just 450k VC. Sure, that's quite a lot. But I'm hyped because that's the final piece we needed for this JR Smith. Oh, let's go. Yeah, flex those muscles. You deserve it, baby. Okay, I don't even care what I'm getting in the rest of this box. We have pulled everything that I needed, every single piece. Now it's time for JR Smith. We get another shake and straight back to back. This is just an amethyst though. It's probably going to be Isaiah Thomas. But yeah, your boy, um, 
Your boy has a smile on his face. It is IT, by the way. Man, imagine if we go back to back to back shakes. I mean, I'd be pretty happy with that. Unfortunately, we don't. How weird is it? I've literally only pulled one DeAndre Jordan. I find that crazy. We've pulled the same amount of DeAndre Jordans as we've pulled pink diamonds. Um, There's another shake though. Another amethyst. I'm glad we got that pink diamond out of the way or else I'd be... uh. Kind of sad, the fact that we've got so many amethysts in this box and it's not a pink diamond. But another Isaiah Thomas, I guess we'll sell him. Nice. But yo, it's time. Chris Middleton is going to be joining the squad. I don't know if I'm ever going to use the card, maybe in like squad builders or something in the future. But as of right now, I'm only excited to get him because then we can finally get J.R. Smith. And it's crazy that we've pulled every single one of these cards that we need. So anyway, pack number 10, no shake here. It's fine because number 11 is one of my favorite numbers. And I know, okay, we get a Sapphire. It's fine. It's a Ben Simmons, no Devin Booker. And 12, okay, Silver and Sapphire, cool. Pas Pascal Siakam, what about number 13 and no shake there either. All right, these packs seem like they're getting pretty bad now. But uh, yeah, I can't say they're bad at all, given that we've got very good ones. We get DeAndre Jordan once again. We've pulled every single card. If you guys don't know, I know I've said it a lot, but it's because I'm hyped. I want to get out of this box. We just pulled Chris Middleton, just his Sapphire. But soon, whoa, we just got an Amethyst coach? Okay, I think that's my first time ever pulling an Amethyst coach. I thought that was like maybe a Hall of Fame badge, but then I realized you can't pull them. You can only get coaches. But yo, what a, what a pack, I guess. I actually think that's my first time ever pulling one. That's crazy. Anyway, we did get DeAndre Jordan as well for now a third time. But what about pack number 18? Okay, this box really hasn't gone well since our pink diamond. But still, I can't complain at all because... We done did it, baby. We done did it. Let's go in. Let's see. That's Sapphire. And then the final pack of this sleeper's box. We are getting a gold in the middle. And that's it. PJ Washington. So, yo, we've still got 55 KBC, but I don't even care. I'm going over to my collection. We're going over to premium. And we're going into the sleepers. And you guys ready? Well, let's actually just say no. But now, let's press triangle. And no, no, okay, wait on. Let's press square, then triangle, and lock in for pink diamond Chris Middleton. Let's go. Okay, well, we got it. How good's that? Let's maybe try again. Is it going to work now? Yep. All right, there we go. Chris Middleton, I like it. And now if we go over to our unopened packs, obviously now we're going to see another pink diamond glow with our boy Chris Middleton. To be honest, I had no idea he played for the Pistons. I can't even lie. But there's the pink diamond and let's flip it and see the man, the myth, the legend, the card that I don't really care about too much. But what I do care about is it's our final piece remaining to be able to get J.R. Smith, small forward from the Detroit Pistons. That is going to be Chris Middleton, just like that. Yeah, yeah. So now that we've got him, if I ever go over to my collection rewards and then over to this one and then go across, for some reason it says I need one more card. Even though literally 2K tweeted out saying I don't need an extra card. Like these are the final five we need. Maybe it's glitched. Maybe I have to go into like my PS4. I don't know. But I'm sure we'll figure it out. And you guys will be seeing a gameplay later today with JR. I'm glad we got this Chris Middleton, even though I'm sure not too many people really care for him. He's got what? An 89.3, not great driving dunk. Like pretty good speed actually, not great defense. Eight Hall of Fame badges. That's actually pretty good. Hot Zone Hunter. Does he come with gold deep threes? Yeah, he does. Yeah, I feel like this is a card that not too many people are hyped about. I think it's just more J.R. Smith. Anyway, we do have a community hub locker code. So let's go over and have a look at this and let's say LaMelo Ball for LaMelo's legacy. And also looking at this largest auction house sale, I'm actually going to sell my LeBron. Before the start of next season, which is in five days, I feel like that's smart. And also I'm thinking about selling my Vince Carter because I was thinking that I'm pretty sure Cam Reddish is going to be better than Vince. So I feel like that's kind of a smart little compromise. But anyway, we'll be figuring all that out on stream. So as I said, be sure to watch it down below. I'm very happy because we pulled every single card needed. And I'm very happy too that we'll be able to get JR Smith gameplay out later today. If I figure out like that one more mystery player, I don't know what's happening there. But yeah, that's pretty much it. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. As I said, let's see if we can get 1,800 likes. I'm pretty sure that's what I asked for. Be sure to follow me on Facebook, link down below. Also on Instagram and Twitter is very much pretty shared. And so I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Smash that like button, subscribe for new. And that's pretty much all I gotta say. Thank you for watching and I'll see you in my next one. Bye.